hindi ko muna kasi dapat i-announce kasi may surprise. Mm. It's sort of a surprise tour mm. for of people na iikot sa Binondo. Uh, para makita yun. Noon, yung dating site na uh, Plato Cusina Chino, Dati Alonso. Although, wala na kami doon since 2008, pero we'd like to show everybody the site na and then uh, also we have some uh, the prepare uh, presentation it's like a manifesto of the brand uh, showcasing the uh, start and lido that was uh, from before actually uh, so the transition the uh, transition Pero in, in celebration po, po, po the anniversary, may mga itatagdag niyo pa kayong mga new parang food dishes sa menu niyo? Menu, yes. Meron kaming uh, every August kasi, every year, o oh, uh, month of August, nag-ano kami nag- uh, narinig naman? Nag-ano? Narinig naman? May nag record kasi. Meron ba yun? Hindi, record naman. <laughs> Every year, uh, when we August, we call it a refresh. 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 We call it a Ma'am, after La Puerza, what made you decide na QC naman na din Mindanao Avenue? Well, Mindanao Avenue actually is the sixth store dito sa Quezon City. Uh, ang first store namin was uh, Iro Gigas, tapos uh, Visayas Avenue, Commonwealth Avenue, Banawe, Quezon Avenue, tsaka ito. So, nakita ko yung ano, yung Siyempre, ang laki kasi ng Quezon City, di ba? And all stores are performing very well. So, ayun, iniisip ko na since meron akong Commonwealth, meron akong Visayas na malalakas, itong Mindanao, specifically yung Barangay Toro, has about 90,000 uh, population. So, ito yung isa sa mga pinakamalaking barangay dito sa Quezon City with, uh, you know, very, very, very vibrant yung community. Maraming businesses, maraming residential. Uh, ayun, kaya we decide na kung open. And the store is doing good. Sana meron pang Mindanao area tulad na nito sa Quezon City. <laughs> In terms po doon sa laki ng hmm. store, um, ito po ba yung pinakamalaki or pare-pareho yung dito sa Quezon City? Um, hindi, hindi, hindi. Nung nag- Open kami sa Iro Gigas, we were actually thinking of delivery, puro delivery lang. Kasi yun yung first store namin sa Quezon City and the first store we had after ng uh, T. Alonso, the Santa Cruz. So, delivery store lang siya, maliit lang. But um, eventually, syempre madami kaming sizes ng store na nabuksan after that. Then, pinag-aralan namin yung financial and everything makita namin na mas ano pa rin uh, parang same effort eh kay malaki yung store kay maliit although ma- maganda rin naman nakita ng maliit na store no pero yung time na i-spend mo sa pag-aalaga ng isang maliit na store is the same uh, is same amount of time na sinispend mo to na mag-alaga ng mga iba-ibang thing uh, eh, ng mas malaki at maliit pareho lang and syempre in terms of uh, return mas ano siya mas malaki yung so this is the ideal, uh, ang, ang pinaka-ideal size, uh, minimum 150 square meters. This one actually maliit lang yung, ang lot namin dito is 130 pero ang, since may up and down siya, so we were able to fit in 110 seats. Maganda, maganda yung size nito. May plans po kayo mag-open pa ng Madami pang branch. <laughs> <laughs> Pero this year. We have just signed up with Robinson's Land. 
nakasign lang namin two weeks ago. And we're gonna open one in uh, along Rojas Boulevard, yung Radiance Manila Bay project ni na condominium project ni uh, Robinson's Land. Tapos, eto si Phoenix, they will be, uh, meron din silang isang site na maganda. Hindi muna sabihin yung place ha, kasi <laughs> baka mausog. <laughs> Pero ayan, yun, yun, yung mga yan, all within the year, ma-open ma sila. So, magamit na, Nina? Mga puti na po. From before, di ba, sabi niya, uh, 